green gemstone. Can I pick that up? It is not mine to take. Okay. How about metal pole? If it isn't nailed down. Oh my gosh. I didn't pick that up last time. What is it? Then chop the metal with a It is unbendable. Okay. Let's save that as metal. Not interested. I have no use for these rust buckets. They do not belong to me, and Varner would not be happy were I to displace them. The tablecloth trick is less impressive when there's nothing on it. Here, more than in any other hall, respect and restraint is well advised. I can't think of any reason to fill my pockets with coal. The alcove matches the dimensions of the armor precisely. The breastplate will not budge. Curved, flat, jagged, or smooth. Delivered by Salty Foam. Some contain sounds, others riches. Sold by the Seashower. I have to find what it is asking for. Something to do with my element, I suspect. I should search the appropriate hall. When this room is used for informal hall get-togethers, mages tend to segregate themselves by element. It is a book of mages, past and present. Sailed the three seas. Is that some type of clue? Perhaps. Or just trade me a healing potion and the combination is yours. The combination is water, water, water. Oh, what do you know? Nice. Let's save that. Water, water, water. Check out our door here. We've done our mission so far. Pretty good. Let's get to... Water, water, water. Yeah. All right. All right. This is part of our I thought you might come this nice. way. Initiates enjoy partaking of the fountain before setting out on their tasks. Calms the nerves. Come, drink. Nice. Nice aquarium, too. Look at the seashell. Works wonders, doesn't it? Of course you would know that. I cannot recall any water mage who has studied our elemental runes as thoroughly as you. I look forward to seeing you join our ranks once your tasks are completed. I remember when you were first brought here. What was it, ten years ago? 
I had not long been initiated myself. Well, perhaps it was a little longer. Never mind that. I wondered then how your mother could give up such a beautiful child to strangers whose ways she could not know. Oh, but I do not mean to dredge up such memories. The past can be as potent as an illusion, and I have spent long enough studying those. You must stay focused on the tasks ahead. This small shell must be a recent addition. Shireen's binding spell hasn't taken effect yet. Shireen, mentor, friend, and water mage. Let's talk to her. Maybe she can give us information. Right now. Initiation. I am pleased to see you undertaking your tests. I knew the first day we met that you would become a great mage. You seem happier now, more than I've ever known you to be. Remember, your influence should be as the tide upon the rocks. Subtle, yet persistent. Elements. May they guide us in all we do and sustain our gratitude. For our power? For delivering us from the folly of humankind. The tower has been my home since I was a child. You cannot be more safe than within these walls. Protective magic aside, in our long history, few mages have sought to harm their kin. Without us, Eliwald would surely fall to the twin scourges, pollution and invention. Let others see through us, for we conceal all in plain sight. Uh, I could not be happier than where I am right now. I have seen many mages pass through this hall over the years, and have taught my fair share. I look forward to you joining our ranks. Craig. One of my most promising students. He has great ambition. I suspect your streams will merge someday. Uh, about something else. Uh, I considered following that path, but it would have deprived me the chance to train the young ones. Too high a price, I felt, for a seat in the hallowed hall. As for the masters themselves, I have always looked up to them, for they represent the best of us and confirm the wisdom of our elements. She remains my mentor and friend, though I see her less often nowadays. When you first came to us, there were some who maintained you were not up to what awaited you. I believed, and still do, that your element chose you for a reason. Find that reason dark, and hold on to it. Where else in the tower can you find a deeper peace? A place to calm and center yourself? Something else? Uh, Igonor. What student of the water would not be content to soak up the tranquility of this province? A post -initiation. Have you given any thought to what you will do after your initiation? To be honest, not really. I thought I'd stay here a bit longer. Maybe specialize in some area or another. Do you ever think about returning home? Sometimes. Most mages don't, though. 
That is true. Many view it as unnecessary. Ten years is a long time. Memories fade. Especially when influenced by our magic. It saves much heartache and allows both Chosen and their families to carry on with their lives. In theory. Do you miss your family, Dark? I miss... recalling their faces, their voices, what they were like, whether they laughed, things like that. You've coped well. I've been kept busy, and I'm grateful I haven't had to spend my life hauling gollogs through the mud. They're the most stubborn creatures you could imagine. All the same, you may permit yourself some time to reflect on where you've come from. It's better to focus on what I'm doing and where I'm going. I don't need the distraction. It's too... <sighs> it's all right. The path of the Chosen is not without its hardships, even if our pain is invisible to others. Staying focused on her tasks. Regrets. Do you regret coming here, Dark? Why would you think that? Sometimes I see it in your eyes. A longing. Sure. To be initiated. It's more than that. You yearn for something. Something you had once, but have lost. If you're referring to my former home, leaving was neither my doing, nor within my control. You resent your lack of choice? Since when do the Chosen get to choose? Don't misunderstand me. I could not have loved my time here more. I just... wonder... How things might have been had your element not chosen you. Yes, but it did. And here I am. Something else. My most recently initiated student, Cray, is hoping to transfer to the Water Tower of Dominatra. I do not fancy his chances. Fierce does not begin to describe the competition there. Awesome. I am not one to gossip, but I have heard a rumor that there may be a big event planned in the capital in the coming months. Expect from this neither the easiest nor fairest of tests. Lurelai Lake must not be underestimated. Though serene in appearance, many have lost their lives to its depths. A realm of isolation, and a just and fitting one at that. She gains perverse gratification from playing with the minds of those who enter her domain. Impressionable guests are often influenced to walk headlong into perilous traps. She makes lies seem as truths, and her truths obscure lies. Amon Kool is a dark and twisted soul, whose tainting of her own water magic has corrupted her beyond redemption. Amonkul was once a water mage, but she discovered a darker path. The priestess was able to avoid detection for some time before the order caught up with her. By then, she had caused unimaginable suffering for the foolish few who followed her. The stories of her misguided followers are equally tragic. They have paid the price for their lack of judgment. Sometimes I wonder if we should have allowed her to persist this long. Still, she retained some usefulness to the masters. One so vain will not give up such a treasure easily. Not when it's unlikely to grow back. Take care. By the way, Dark... If you have not yet visited the Observation Hall, you should do so. How do I access it? Try Light Air Air. I heard a rumor that one of them ate an initiate. 
a fire mage. So it serves him right. A fountain of mage's water. My mana is already filled up. No point in wasting mage's water. True, but we do have an empty flask to fill. Hey! The water refuses to enter the flask. The fountain requires a donation of precious metal. 10 gold coins. You will need an empty flask to contain the water. 10 gold, 10 coins for the fountain. Alright, let's buy it. There, I filled my flask with mage's water. Alright then, we got it. Look at our item. Throw our water for the fountain. My magical power is at maximum capacity. No point in wasting mage's water. Every fish one could ever want to see. I could watch them for hours. Come to think of it, I have. A place to rest, recharge, and restore. Unpleasant thoughts are impossible here. Shireen has a minimalist approach to furnishings. Quite right, too. Shireen has a quite right too. Next to these, I feel like a mi- Dark. Before you go, okay, what, what, what? sometimes I glimpse the dreams of those closest to me. Often they make little sense, but yours of late have been clear. I dream of demons, whatever they mean. You dream of greatness, the mightiest of mages. Is that a bad thing? If one's motives are pure, no. But few achieve so delicate a balance, and fewer still maintain it. What are you saying? Let the trials you face reflect your true nature. The lessons you learn will serve you, perhaps even save you. Good luck, Dark. <laughs> 